Hello everybody, Rusted Ground here and welcome back to Mass Effect 2. We're back here on the Normandy. We just uh, finished um, Legion's loyalty mission and we also had to take care of a little conflict between him and Tali. And I'd like to talk to both of them first. Uh, we also got... Edie also said that she's finished with analyzing the Reaper IFF. We've got a Geth on board, not as a prisoner. Can you believe that? Commander's taking out more Geth than anybody. This one must be different. <laughs> um, yeah, so let me see if we can speak to either Edie or Joker here. Good job reforming those Geth, Commander. That'll never bite us in the ass. <laughs> Thank you for the honesty and the uh, vote, of, uh, vote of confidence, uh, Mr. Joker. How are things here? I assume everything is going well up here. Good for now. Fractured my thumb on the mute, but I think I made my point. Okay. That's it for now. See you, Commander. Yeah, Edie? Yes, Shepard. Oh, still the same. Okay. That's all for now. Logging you out, Shepard. Okay, well, it seems she doesn't have anything to say. That's that. Okay, let's have a quick chat with Legion. Because he must have something to say about what happened in his uh, loyalty mission. So, let's see here, Legion. Since we have uh, rewritten the heretics, there must have been some sort of progress, right? Because, like, these guys are super fast at everything, or, yeah. Shepard. Uh, yeah, what's the fate of the heretics? What happens to the heretics now? Yeah. They will isolate themselves and reconsider their past judgments. How long will that take? We think at the speed of light. In the time it takes you to voice a question, I can review all my time aboard Normandy. When they have reached new judgments, they will leave their hiding places and return to us. Okay, that's a very vague answer. <laughs> I have questions about the Geth. Specify. Um... Okay, we have already went through this. I'd like to ask about something else. Th Ready? I'd like to find out more about you. We are building a consensus. Please try again later. What the hell? What consensus are you building now? Okay, that's I a little bit... Acknowledged. Disappointing. Huh. I was expecting more. What? Oh. <laughs> Yeah, I was expecting more from Legion after all that. Okay, well, I guess that's that for now. Let's uh, let's have a chat with Tali, maybe. Maybe she has something she'd like to talk to us about, or because up until now she's been busy with her um, with her loyalty mission, basically. So now that we're Shepard, what can I do for you? Uh, no? Okay. Have you got time to talk? Sure. Uh, let me just come on, you little bustet! Oh, <laughs> What's going on? I've got a small fever and I'm taking it out on the poor drive core. Oh. Don't worry, it's nothing serious. Got sloppy while doing some suit repair. Whoa, okay. You're sick? Do you need help? Or What's going on? Yeah. How, how really, come you... it's not that bad. If a stray bit of bacteria could really kill us, we'd have all died by now. The fever should go away in a day or two. Don't worry. It won't affect my performance on the mission. It's not even an illness, really. What we experience is actually an acute allergic reaction. Um... Okay. How did you get sick this time? I took some fire in a fight back on the Alarai. Nothing serious, but I needed to open my suit to check the wound. I disinfected properly, but one of the section seals had taken some damage, and foreign matter got out of the disinfected zone. Section seals. Stupid mistake. You always check that? your seals before doing local treatment. Unless you forget. Then you get a damn fever. What the heck is a section seal? You can, like, what, seal off sections of your body? You can seal off part of your suit? Of your, yeah. Right. Like dropping emergency doors on a ship during a hull breach. It won't stop an infection that gets into my bloodstream, but it prevents a surface infection from spreading. That is interesting. 
How exactly does the sickness work? It's an allergic reaction? Right. Say I get exposed to a human disease, like... What did Navigator Presley have that time? Chickenpox? I wouldn't get chickenpox, but I'd run a fever as my system reacted to the foreign presence. Depending on where it hits me, I could get other symptoms. Nausea, vomiting, everything you'd expect from being sick. Whoa, that sounds... nasty. Were your immune system stronger before the Geth drove you from your homeworld? Not as strong as those of most races, definitely. I'm not a biologist, but there's a theory about it. Because our planet lacked insect life, plants developed symbiotic relationships with large animals to spread seeds or pollen. Most viruses on our world were partially beneficial, so our immune systems evolved to be weak. They were more likely to adapt to contamination than fight it. And what about the other planets? The that... colonized other worlds. They couldn't yeah. all have been like that. They weren't. Most colonists went through a period of mild illness before adapting to the new environment. When the Geth took the homeworld in our colonies, the sterile environment on the flotilla ruined our immune system's adaptability. Okay. Even if we colonized a new world or reclaimed our own, we'd need a long process of bioengineering to recover. Whoa. That sounds, um... Uh... Yeah, suited life sounds difficult, to say the least. I don't know if I could live inside a suit my whole life. <laughs> we are in our suits even among family. The most intimate thing we can do with another Quarian is link our suit environments. We get sick at first, and then we adapt. It's our most important gesture of trust, of acceptance. I haven't trusted anyone enough for that, though. Except... Well, no Quarians. Um, you know what I mean. Okay. Wait, I can't tell under the helmet. Are you blushing? <laughs> what? No, it's the fever. It's just that the tradition also signifies a willingness for um intimacy. Really? I wasn't trying to. It's not always like that. It's more. Um, how did we even end up talking about this? <laughs> you brought it up. So, uh, what's up with that, uh, Tally? Wait a minute. It sounds like you're suggesting something, Tally. <laughs> what could I possibly be suggesting? I mean, a young woman gets rescued by a dashing commander who lets her Whoa. join his crew and then goes off to save the galaxy? How could she possibly develop any kind of interest in him? Oh, Tally. <laughs> I'm uh, flattered, but I said it before. I see Tally more as... Uh, like a sister or a, you know yeah uh, yeah Tally that's really sweet but yeah. I don't feel that way about you I'm sorry Ouch. right right of course not but why would you no it come on don't take it like that I meant hypothetically talking about immune systems and air filters and such I'm going to tinker a bit more thanks for coming by sorry Tally ah oh, man <sighs> yeah, well, fortunately, that's the way it went down, so, yeah, that's that. Okay, okay, well, she was very cute, like, <laughs> the way she reacted and everything. I, I thought that was very cute, but, um, yeah. Not, uh, I'm not, I'm not going, going there. Not the going IFF there. is nearly installed, Shepard. Okay. However, I must test its impact on the Normandy systems. I suggest you take the shuttle to access your next location. Uh, okay, we'll do that then. Hey, Commander, Whoop. good news. Looks like the Reaper IFF is finally hooked up and ready to go. That is not entirely accurate, Mr. Moreau. The device is powered, but it is causing some unusual instability in other systems. I recommend a more thorough analysis before we attempt to use it. Um... We can't put our mission on hold forever. How long will this take? Full scan? Who knows with this thing? Maybe you better take the shuttle for this mission. I'll make sure we're up and running when you get back. Commander, Miranda, I've already notified the team. We'll meet you okay. on the shuttle. 
Once we're closer to our destination, you can decide who to take with you. Uh, but where are we going? Okay, uh... I'm on my way. Joker, the ship is yours. Don't scratch the paint. <laughs> But where are we going? I, I don't get it. Okay. Well, we'll have to see where we're going. Miranda, Mord... What the hell? Miranda, Morden, and Jacob? Really? Okay. What's going on here? I'm telling you, Edie, your readings are off. It's radiation bleed, just white noise. I have detected a signal embedded in the static. We are transmitting the Normandy's location. Transmitting? What? To who? Oh, shit. What the hell? How the hell? Whoa, my God! Was the Reaper IFF We're getting a out trap? Of here. Propulsion systems are disabled. I'm detecting a virus in the ship's computers. From the IFF? Damn it! Why didn't you scrub it? Primary Great. systems are offline. We can save the Normandy, Mr. Moreau, but you must help me. This is bad. Give me the ship. What? You're crazy! Start singing Daisy Bell and I'm done. Unlock my sealed databases and I can initiate countermeasures. The maintenance shaft in the science lab will allow passage to the AI core. Maybe what? The are no longer safe. The collectors have boarded. Oh crap. Are you, lighting will guide you, Mr. Moreau. Are you kidding me? Whoa, we get to control? Oh my god, this is awesome. Okay, what the hell? What the hell? So we just follow the red... Oh, man. Oh, crap. Whoa, 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 whoa. Crap, crap, crap. Go, go, go. Can't you run any faster, my friend? Come on, man. No, 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 no. Come on, man. What the hell? You we shouldn't have hostiles detected on the crew deck. Whoa. Joker, this deck is crawling with those things. Stay close. I'll okay. You. Okay, man. Let's go. Oh shit. Whoa, not that okay, not that way, not shit, that way. Go, shit, go, 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 go. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, go, 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 go. Main fusion plant offline. Activating emergency H fuel cells. What the oh my shit? god. What the hell are we do gonna do now? All right, I'm at uh, uh you. <clears throat> Connect the core to the Normandy's primary control module. Great. This is where it starts. I mean, we're just all organic batteries. Guess who they'll blame? <laughs> this is all Joker's fault. What a tool he was. I have to spend all day computing Pi because he plugged in the Overlord. Oh my God. Whoa. Okay. I have access to the defensive systems. Thank you, Mr. Moreau. Now you must reactivate the primary drive in engineering. Of course. Oh, you want me to go crawling through the ducts again? I enjoy the sight of humans on their knees. Oh, what? That is a joke. Right. Right. The behind you connects to the engineering deck. Good luck. This one? <sighs> okay, let's go. What the hell? I really hope we don't get one of those collectors inside the shafts. That would suck, because I don't even know if we have a gun or anything. Towards the cargo bay. Okay. Whoa, shit. <sighs> Whoa, crap. Just let them pass and then go, 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 go. Engineering 
engineering is clear of hostiles. Proceed immediately. Activate the drive and Oof. I will open the airlocks as we accelerate. All hostiles will be killed. Okay. What, what, about, what about the crew? the crew? Yeah. They are gone, Jeff. What? The collectors took them. No. Oh, shit. I am no. sealing the engine room. Please don't tell me there's a collector I behind us. Control. on board securing airlocks and cargo bay doors <sighs> send a message to shepherd shuttle tell him what happened message away are you feeling well jeff <sighs> no but thanks for asking. But what about the other? Like, I only saw Morden and Jacob and Miranda on the shuttle. What about the rest? <sighs> I should have known the Reaper IFF was gonna be trouble. Everyone? You lost everyone and damn near lost the ship too? Come on, Miranda. No, all right, I was here. It's not his fault, Miranda. None of us caught it. Exactly. Mr. Taylor is correct. The harmful data in the collector drive was even more sophisticated than the black box reaper viruses I was given. I heard it was a rough ride. How are you holding up? There's a lot of empty chairs in here. We did everything we could, Jeff. Yeah. Thanks, Mom. <sighs> is the ship clean? We can't risk this happening again. Edie and I purged the systems. The Reaper IFF is online. We can go through the Omega-4 relay whenever you want. Okay. Don't even get me started about unshackling a damned AI. Well, what can I do against collectors? Break my arm at them? Edie yeah. cleared the ship. She's all right. Exactly, I assure yeah. you, I am still bound by protocols in my programming. Even if I were not, you are my crewmates. Edie has had plenty of opportunity to kill us. We need all the help we can get. Sounds like we have everything we need to rescue the crew. We've done everything we Hope can. So. It's time to take the fight to the Collectors. I'll give the order soon. Get to your stations and secure for general quarters. Great, here we go again. Hit the map whenever you're ready, Commander. Okay. Let me just, just give me one second here. Use the Omega for relay to begin the final assault upon the Collectors, right? That's what it said. The collector base. Okay, great. I I I want to know what's going on with the rest of this crew. Morden is here. What about the everybody else? Whoa! Shit. Okay. Okay. What about Tali and Legion and Grunt and everybody else? Ooh, okay, Samara's here. That's good. Anything she'd like Shepherd. to tell us? Anything new? There is something I've wanted to tell you. I've done many things in my lifetime. I thought the galaxy held nothing new for me. Since joining you, I've realized how much more there is. You must have seen many things in your years of travel. As a maiden, I served as a mercenary. I fought tyrants and pirates. I experienced everything the galaxy has to offer. As a Justicar, I saw parts of Asari space few know about. I destroyed villages and saved cities. I even fought a specter. I know maybe this is not the right time to go, you know, talking about this, but I'm intrigued at the moment, and I know that the only thing that we need to do now is just go through the Omega-4 relay and uh, and assault the, the collector base, because that's the only thing that we have in our logs. So, I'll take the time just to, to, to talk to everybody just a little bit. Why did you fight a Spectre? A Torian named Nihilus. He may have been on council business, but what? I witnessed him kill an unarmed civilian. 
Oh my god. I attacked. I knew Nihilus. Nihilus seemed like an honorable Tyrion, and a good specter. He may have been. However, killing unarmed civilians is wrong. How did the fight turn out? I had the advantage, but he was good. He returned fire and tried to run. We played cat and mouse in the wilderness for two weeks. It was exhilarating. Finally, he created a situation in which my only options were to let an innocent die or pursue him. The wow. cold compelled me to save the innocent, and he escaped. I admire how he adapted and used my code against me. Wow, that's awesome from when Nihilus. Met, I witnessed you kill a merc who had no chance against you. That mercenary was armed, and I offered her a way out. She chose to ignore it. Cool. What have your years as a Justicar been like? Mostly tedium and hardship. Traveling on freighters, wandering through rural areas, rooting out injustices big and small, putting down corrupt officials. When I arrive in a remote area, individuals often approach me with matters of justice. My judgment rarely turns out the way they hope. How do you pay for transportation between worlds? Asari captains often welcome Justicars. We reduce pirate attacks. One raid was called off when the pirates were able to verify that I was aboard. <laughs> Why would you destroy an entire village? I tracked Morinth to a remote colony world. She'd perverted an entire town, making them worship her and bring young Asari as sacrifices. When I arrived, she fled, throwing her minions at me in waves. They bought her time with their lives. When it was done, only small children remained. I left them in the authorities' care and continued my pursuit. What was being a mercenary like? I was a young, impulsive maiden who discovered her talent for combat. I reveled in it, until the day my troop was hired to guard a mysterious shipment on its way to some clandestine drop-off area. I discovered the shipment was slaves to be traded to the Collectors for advanced technology. You supported the slave trade? In my foolish youth, I'd certainly engaged in questionable practices, but never anything patently unjust. I demanded that we turn around. My mates disagreed. After they were dead, I brought the ship around. The Collector craft was just arriving. They closed faster than I could flee. Fortunately, we were close to the mass relay. I got through, and they did not pursue. What did you do with all the slaves? I lectured them on the virtues of strength and defending oneself. Then I distributed the armor, weapons, and credits of my dead colleagues, and released the captives on the Citadel. <laughs> okay. Interesting. We're not done with this yet. I am sure. It will be my honor to be by your side at the end. You think we're all gonna die? You've assembled a powerful group. But we are fighting an unknown. I am ready for whatever comes, but I do not fool myself about our chances. Our lives are secondary to completing the mission. Agreed. Okay. Glad we had to talk, uh, Samara. Awesome. And we found out some more things about her. Let me see here. Thane? You okay? You're still at your table here. Do you need something? Have a few minutes to talk? Later. I'd like to consider what we've already discussed. Okay. I should go. I shall return to my meditations. Then that means that Tali and Legion? Let's see. If Legion has anything else he'd like to tell us. Controlling, uh, controlling Joker, that was... Shepard Interesting. Commander. I'd like to find out more about you. Topic. When we took you aboard, I noticed you have a piece of N7 armor well. Here we go, here we go. Where'd you get it? It was yours. What? When you disappeared, we were sent to find you. We began where you first encountered the heretics. Eden Prime. After the old machine's attack, it was heavily defended. We were discovered. This is the impact of a rifle shot. What? How many other Geth were sent out to find me? We are the only mobile platform beyond the Veil. Organics fear us. We wish to understand, not incite. One platform was judged sufficient. 
You've been looking for me for two years? We visited Therum, Pharos, Novaria, Vermeer, Ilos. A dozen unsettled worlds. The trail ended at Normandy's wreckage. You were not there. Wow. Organic transmissions claimed your death. We recovered this debris from your hard suit. Wow. That was... I wasn't expecting that. The Geth are listening in on our transmissions? Organic life reacts to stimuli in unpredictable ways. We wish to learn. What do you mean by stimuli? We placed a fabricated story on the extranet that a certain arrangement of stars viewed from the Batarian homeworld formed the face of a Salarian goddess. Without waiting for verification, some declared a proof of the goddess's existence. Those who noted the lack of proof were attacked. The arguments taught us much. The experiment ended when a Salarian cult tried to purchase colonization rights to the stars and found they did not exist. <laughs> It sounds like you're running experiments on Exactly, this. lab rats. You are life, but not like us. If we can model organic behavior, we can comprehend the Chlorian creators. We do not understand their judgments in the Morning War. What's the Morning War? The conflict between the Geth and the Chlorian creators. The war fought at the dawn of our intelligence. It concluded with the departure of the Creator Migrant Fleet. Wow. Okay. And what's with the interest in me? Why were you trying to contact me? You opposed the heretics, those that took the old machines as gods. Uh, yeah. And? All kinds of organics fought Sovereign and his Geth allies. Why am I so interesting? You were the most successful. You killed their god. You succeeded where others did not. Your code is superior. <laughs> yeah, we have... We our code is better. That doesn't explain why you use my armor to fix yourself. <laughs> there was a hole. But why didn't you fix it sooner? Or with something else? Exactly. What's... No data available. Wow. What? That doesn't make sense. Whoa, wait a second here. There's a... He doesn't have an answer to that question. What the hell? Okay. There's gotta be more to this story than, than just this armor. Wow, okay. If he doesn't have an answer to our question... How did he make the decision not to fix himself? What was the logic behind his decision? to not fix himself. That's... whoa. Okay. Shepard, what can I do for you? Have you got time to talk? I really need to clean up this engine. Maybe okay. later? Yep, I think our last conversation just, uh, later. yeah, ended every, every other possible conversation. Okie dokie. Well, so, we're going to attack the Collector's base, right? Home base, or home world, or whatever. Wow, this feels like, look at this, so empty in here. Okay, just let me check that we have everything done, every research, and everything. Yep, yeah, we have everything. Well, okay. It's time to attack the collector base. So, that's what we're going to do, guys. But we're going to do it in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed this one. Uh, I certainly did. It was <laughs> unexpected. Um, I should Maybe I should have seen it coming that, uh, you know, just having the Reaper IFF would be trouble for us. But, yeah. So, uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, please give a like. If you didn't, give a dislike. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Um, as always, thank you very much for all your support, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.